everybody, Indy here, back again with another edition of Sled Shed TV. We have our parts for our Formula Z, and we're going to finish our rebuild today. So come on along, we'll go back here, show you what they sent us, and we'll get right to it. Okay, so here's what we got. We got SPI T-Molly series kits with the Molly coated pistons wrist pins, wrist pin bearing, and your circ clips. And it also came with a full Windorosa gasket kit. So I was going to order Weisco. Uh, Weisco is a good performance piston, very lightweight. But I think for this, for a trail sled, I think a T-Molly coated piston is going to last a little longer. In fact, the Polaris that we had that we used to run has over 3,000 miles with the T-Molly coated pistons in it. So I really like these and this is what we're going to go with. So let's go over to the sled and we'll start putting the pistons in. Okay, so you're going to want to put a rag around your open areas so you don't have any parts going down inside your engine. We're going to install our wrist pin bearing and we're going to want to lube this up. We're going to use a little uh, Klotz assembly lube on this. And this is the only part that you're going to put any lube on. Next is our piston and wrist pin. Notice the arrow. The arrow wants to be facing towards the exhaust. Now your wrist pin's in, you want to put in your circlips. Okay, so as you can see our pistons are on, wrist pins are in, circlips are in, we're ready to go. So what we want to do is Put a gasket in right like that. Then we want to put our cylinders on. Base bolts go in. Make them all snug. And then you're going to torque. Make sure you check your manual for the torque specs. Remember, slow, steady pull. We'll get to your snap. Okay, so now they're on. Next thing we do is put the head on. Quite a head gasket here. Okay, now we're all on. Now we gotta do is put our plumbing on, put the spark plugs back in, and uh, we'll give her a shot, see what she does. Okay, so everything's in. We're all plumbed up, everything's tight. Now's the moment of truth, so let's start it up. Oh, 
you must have done something right. Is everything's fine. You want to look in here for any leaks? I don't see anything. Our plugs are tight. All our hoses are tight. Next thing we got to do is we got to go out and take it for a test drive. All right. So we're going to go out and take it for a test drive now. We had it up on the stand. Let's go see how it runs. works very good so that's that it's another rebuild down the steam you see is from some antifreeze that I had dumped when we were filling the bottle up so other than that she's working good so for that I'm Indy if we don't see you before we'll see you on the trail <laughs>